<laughs> All right. Yes, we are streaming. It is 2021, and you thought it'd be better than 2020. Oh boy, this this year's off to a good start. I mean, look, right? We have a flooded city after all. That's not a good thing. Not a good thing at all. Yeah. Right. So I wanted to start talking about this a little bit. I have been playing a game called Fey Tactics, which I'm not exactly sure how to describe. Because the only game I know that does it like this, or, well, two. I know two games that do it like this. One I own that I haven't played, and one I've only seen. Um... Tell me, have you seen what the original Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories looked like? I've seen Kingdom Hearts, but I haven't been familiar with Chain of Memories. It was a completely different battle system. I think it was originally tailored for the GBA. Is it more of a tactical RPG? Yes. Oh! Where you have, uh, what is it? You have, you have like, squares, right? And it's set in, like, an isometric perspective. So, you know, like, not quite top-down, but, like, catty-corner down, I guess, if you're looking from, like, a cube perspective. Kind of like Banner Saga's battle angle? A little bit, but more pixely and, like, more up in a corner. Okay. Um, but it, it's kind of like that. Uh, you have turns like you would a JRPG based on your character's speed stat. Um, and the world seems interesting, where it's like there are uh, there is a, a human world at one point and like a world of the fairies. And some shit went down before you were born, and the world's kind of conjoined in a mass like destructive com combining of one another, right? And yeah. now, you know, fairies are dicks, and humans are dicks, and nobody trusts or likes each other. There, there are very few, like, there are like a handful of humans that eventually, like, end up being born on occasion that can wield magic powers of their own, which we are one of them. Mm-hmm. Um, and the whole, I guess, point of the game is that you as a character like to help people out, but you're also searching for your mother. Oh! You don't know where she is. And all you know is that your mother is a cool badass. Prediction! Your mother is a fairy. Oh, I would not be surprised if there was an everything going on. Um, so there are those fairies that are humanoid, and then there are other ones that are outright just monstrous. Mm, mm. Um, what else was I going to say? Oh, uh, I was going to I say... I think that's the last of the machines. Uh, 2B, mm -hmm. 9S, come in. Commander? Big missile. Emergency yeah. orders incoming. The carrier ship that was set to resupply has come under attack. It's currently being engaged by a swarm of machines. I've asked all your troops in the city ruins for assistance, and I'll need you to provide backup as well. I'm sending flight units and coordinates now. Good luck. Out. Ooh! I like that! Mechas! Yes! Yeah. Total slave driver. <laughs> if she didn't order others around, what kind of leader would she be? Hmm. If you say so. Also, here's our favorite friend. Yes. Away! You, <laughs> you, 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 you want to take over his his dialogue? I, I completely forgot he was he was here. <laughs> <coughs> Whoa well, there! This place is closed, kind sir and or madam, but we are not. This is absolutely there's absolutely nothing. A value here, so don't let it distract you and run along now. Hmm. But Uh-huh. Oh my go god. On. Go on. Oh my god, I I I can see where this is going. Go on. <clears throat> but I can't just send you off empty-handed now, can I? 
I'd love to give you a souvenir of some kind. But if I have nothing on me right now, what to do? What to do? Hmm, should I blow myself up? I, I know, I will self-destruct for your convenience. <laughs> this will result in a rain of useful materials. They are yours to keep. Ah yes, fortune sm smiles upon you today. Have a great day. Once you have collected my gifts, please forget everything you saw here. That's a promise. You're here? Goodbye. <laughs> I, only got 80, I only got 80 G out of that. That wasn't worth it. Get, I gotta reconstruct you so you can blow up again. What the shit? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I love that guy. <laughs> Um, but yes, I, I, I have been playing the, the Fey Tactics game. Um, you also get summons in that game to increase your party size. Like, you get three party members. You start off with um, a blue water bird and a dog. And I've gotten to the point where I've gotten one other party member, which is a centaur. Each of which have, like, their own elementals. Um, a dog? Yes, a dog. Like, there, like there is a, literally just a melee element, which is what he is. Like a ferocious German Shepherd or a fluffy Corgi? Uh, probably closer to the German Shepherd. I'm not quite sure what, uh, what breed it is. Okay. Um, but yeah. You, you start out with those two. I've gotten a Centaur as my, my fourth ally, and each... This is what actually drew me to it, was that... For your summons, either, every time you beat one, there's a chance they'll drop a card that you can then use to use them as one of your summons. Ooh! So I'm like, oh, it's got a Pokemon aspect. I'm interested. This should be cool. So I've been playing that, and it is interesting, but goddamn is it difficult. And I forget what difficulty I set it at, but I want to see if I can change it to be simpler, because I'm garbage at this. Like, there's backstab attacks, and you get behind an enemy, you can stab them. Shmup! Yes! Are you happy now? You get your shmups? I know how much you like this. Also, we're gonna be here for a minute. Speaking about shmups, I got Dodon Patchy. I have no idea what that is. Um, it is a cave. Shooter by like Kate, like Cave Company. I think no, I think they just called Cave, and it's a bullet hell. Okay. It is quite different than Toho. I was gonna say you're I getting would, your Toho. I would say it's a little bit more like this with machines, and I'm I don't know if it's like less patterny. Then Toho because Toho has some beautiful bullet patterns. Mm -hmm. This just seems to be like bullets from all angles. It, of course, there's the bullet hell tiny tiny hitbox. Um, but one thing is interesting: there is bullet canceling. I don't know how you trigger it, but what, what do you mean bullet cancel? Cancel like did you hit? You shoot your bullets, and your bullets cancel out uh, bullets? Yes. Bullets? Yes. Okay. And there's also laser canceling, which is really interesting that you're in some kind of Dragon Ball Z beam battle. <laughs> I haven't got into that Attention, this is Carrier Blue Ridge 2. Yet. Requesting support from any friendly units in range. Maybe the final boss will have like, a fire beam from the battle enemy. or something? Our escort ship has taken damage and is unable to engage. We're currently resisting with all remaining support fighters, but we can't hold them off for long. I repeat, this is Carrier Blue Ridge 2. We need immediate but backup from any available Android forces. Having a ship instead of a cute girl fighting other cute girls. I mean, you can't be a cute girl all the time. Right, right. Sometimes you have to be a cute girl driving some weapon shards 
spaceship or something. Oh, shit. So, remember when I talked about Tim Rogers, the guy that does, like, these absurdly long reviews? Yes? He just dropped another one, like, a week or two ago. I'm picking up a large-scale enemy about... inbound. Looks to be 2.8 clicks southwest of us. It, oh, hello. Uh, it, it's about... I'm gonna, I'm gonna butcher this. I'm trying to remember the name of the game, but it's a Japanese game that never got translated in the West. Oh. It's called a Pokemon Memorial or something like that. I've Pokemon heard of that. Memorial or something like that one. Yeah, it's a text adventure. No. They it is a dating sim. Oh. Well, dating sims are like ten percent text adventure. I mean, this one's also got, like, stats to make sure that you're, you know, good-looking enough for characters, too. Okay, so yeah, I have heard of it. Um, it's like a six-hour review, where apparently he went through the game 14 times for each character, and then played, like, sequel series to make that game. A six-hour review! Yes. Enemy area unit destroyed. Reverting back to area recon. Wait, I'm still picking up a large enemy presence. Didn't I kill that already? What on? Watch this. If it's that big, we should be able to see it. It is the ship. Yes! It's not the ship. Wait, is a whale? Well, that's new. Is it a whale? It's like some Lobo Kaiju whale <laughs> thing! Is that a machine? It's freaking huge. It's like some whale Kaiju robot thing! I don't know, man. There might be more going on here. Do you ever consider there might be more here? You mean there's a it's smaller whale inside? The blast. We've got to find another way to damage it's it. It's like those. It's fucking Russian alien. It just comes. It's like alien. It just comes out its mouth. To be. It's like a Command, Russian nesting doll. Satellite laser there's like twelve whales inside. But the enemy's also magnetic camouflage is making it impossible to aim. We need you to find the emitter and take it out. Oh, is that all? I know, I know, but it's the only way. EMP generator target confirmed. Marking on map. Proposal. Destroy the generator quickly. Let me, like... I'm just gonna bump you a little bit on my mixer. Just to make yeah, sure... I, there we go. Yeah, I was saying the game audio was just a tad bit loud, maybe? Yeah, there we go. That should do it. Um, okay. But, yeah. Yeah, you, you want to go on and finish your thought about the six-hour game review? What? That that's all I'm just going to say like Wow. That's like amazing amounts of detail. Like he and goes off into a story about his own love life at one ahead. point. The only to, like, record compare of this it to like life form is a lone sighting. How he ignored this game as a child because it wasn't cool. Land, it wasn't like about shooting electromagnetic things with other attack. things. All it was all talking to girls. Were so basically, and on how if he had done it back in the day, perhaps he would have been better at talking to girls. So how much of his videos are typically non sequiturs? It's weird though. Like I don't even know if I can call it a non sequitur because it does loop back around. Like it somehow miraculously loops itself back in. No, no, but it meant like those non sequiturs those non oh, things. Like, it's hard to differentiate. I'll be honest. It's very hard. Because, like, oh. every time he refers whatever he's talking to straight back to the game. Like, and, and it's, it's not even like he's, um... It's not even like he's, uh... He, he's like off on a complete and utter tangent. 
it literally, like, I don't know, what, he goes off on a story, and in the middle of the story, he's also, like, still referring to the game during it. So, okay, let me rephrase that. How much of his material is typically side stories? It varies a lot. It's hard to oh. say. But would you say at least 25% of the video is side story? I'm gonna, if you really want me to put a hard number on this, I'm gonna have to say somewhere between 40 Forty percent to fifty percent. Wow! Magnetic interference eliminated. Preparing for satellite landing. And I thought we went off on tangents. Oh, hey, look at that! Satellite yeah. shot. And it didn't work. Oh come on! It's got an electromagnetic barrier over its whole body. Yes, that's why it's amazing. It's an amazing <laughs> robo kaiju robot sure. thing. Hunter Squadron deploying out of North 12C Defense HQ. I'm the commanding officer, 4B. Don't worry, we'll take it from here. Oh, they got this. Why are we no, they to don't. Be? Let's leave this area to the reinforcements. I have an idea. You and I should meet up at the spot I just marked. They got this. Come on. Don't tell me they don't got this. They totally got this. They don't got this. We've got mortars lining the shoreline here. All the EMP shielding in the world won't help against close range mortar fire. Got it. I'm just randomly laying in the sea. Alright. Oh, yeah. I'll help Bane. What? Ready? Yeah? Stay on, big guy. This thing's armor is too thick. Oh, I gotta wait we need more firepower. 2B, let's try for a more direct approach. Direct? Oh, right. That's right. Lay down some fire in its stupid mouth. Ha! Come on. There we go. Aw, oh, are you kidding me? That was in. Oh my god, this is amazing. Open up, big boy. Come on. There it is. But oh my god, a like, six hour review. That's. <laughs> like I said, that's an amazing amount of detail. Uh huh. Oh my god. Well, he also half like, like, half the time is talking to, like, Duke Nukem, like, yeah, and then we had to do it like this. But then he goes into, like, a squealing, like, broken teenager voice at some points. Like, I was really wondering if women were interested in this stuff. Huh. Like, shit like that. Oh, oh, and Oh, it's not speaking... dead, by the way. Did you notice? Oh my god, it has a secondary mode! It has a secondary mode! <laughs> what? To me! What? We gotta bail, to me. What's going on? This is bad. Oh, my bad. Oh. What? What's going on? <laughs> it's a big monster. It's a big kaiju robot. That looks like it's half to the well, that didn't go too well. Oh! Oh! Okay. Hey, Pascal. How's it going? That enormous machine is an ancient weapon. It was designed to help annihilate the androids, but it wound up going out of control. I was part of the machine's network when it happened, so I remember it. The moment it reached land, went berserk and begin attacking everything in sight. No one could figure out how to stop it. We eventually marooned it deep in the ocean, but it seems to be searching for a way back. Huh. Hey, 2B. I think I have another idea. You keep that thing right where it is, okay? What? Please, 2B. This is gonna work. I don't know, man. You think Manes has this? 
as long as it doesn't involve Nine pulling down his cash for Proposal. 2B, Nine then I think it might. To command as a deserter. <laughs> no! He has a plan. Just hold on. I mean, I, I gotta ask, what makes you think that Rip and Andrews even have genitals? Shut up. This is my own thing where 9S is a pervert and is <laughs> badly in love with 2B. I'm going to see if we can use those missiles back on the shore, but I need you to destroy the EMP unit on that thing's back. Otherwise, they're just going to go off course. On. Oh my god, this is insane. Man, look at us. We're going, we're going for him. We're going to get him. We're going to get him, boys. Oh my god. You know, Pascal's just here like, yeah, I'm floating. It's cool. <clears throat> oh, and speaking That's about dating... Speaking, speaking about dating sims, um, the one that I was half looking at was pushed back, a, like, to sometime this year, but they can't give us a hard date because they have two other games that are currently out that are more free to play clicker games and they said they're still working on new content for those so also that so they said once the, the scripts are fully voiced they will give a better idea This is very explosion-y. Are you sure you can hear me? I can hear you pretty good, yeah. Okay, okay. There we go. He didn't need that, but... Okay. Oh my god. Look at how big he is. Isn't he cute? Ooh, that one hit me. How you like this Robo Kaiju? I'm just trying to think of a cool name for it. <laughs> like, like Anzara, God of the Whales. I'm pretty sure he's got his own name. We just gotta look it up a little bit. I'm trying to look at what it is. Oh my god. So when we started this game, did you think you were gonna get Robo Kaiju? Honestly? No! Or did you think that uh, Angle, the, the first one we fought, was it? Uh, I, I honestly don't know. Oh god, I gotta hear another one of these things. Ah, uh, these, these. Like, this is the worst part about this section. It's just how long this is. Yeah. It's it's the one section in the game that I can remember that like hate feels like it takes forever. Yeah. Have explosions and lasers. Yes, plenty of explosions and lasers. Oh my god. Maybe I should have grinded to like try to get section go faster. I didn't even think about it because I forgot until we got to how bad it was. But that's only level 18! I know! When we're 26, that thing's level 10. Oh. There we go. A missile impact! What? Hmm, who shot that? Wow. Oh. S Commander lost signal the field. Lost. lost the signal. Huh. 2B. 9S. 
don't die on me. Why? They could just replace us. We're robots. <laughs> that line's never made sense to me. We're, we're literally robots. You, we get bo new bodies all the time. Use our old AI that we backed up on the, on the on the fucking thing, on the bunker. Well, we survived. Mm, yeah, but where's 9S? Oh no. Oh look, there's the corpse. <laughs> um, I'm hearing a little bit of me echoey. I don't hear an echo at all. Oh, okay. Uh, do you think we can call it an episode here? To bunker. Come well, in. Let, let us, Over. Let us talk Operator to the bunker for a second. To B? Okay. To B, are you all right? Running system diagnostics. Core functionality appears intact. Thank goodness. Never mind that. I need a status report. I gotta Roger start that. In regards to the giant machine that attacked the shore, it ceased its resistance eight hours ago following your missile strike. Eight oh, we've been out for eight hours. hours. However, it's huh. EMP strikes knocked out comms all across the region. We're having trouble getting them back online, which means data uploading is currently unavailable in some areas. Where's 9S? Um, yeah, about that. We picked up a faint black box reading, but it wasn't strong enough to lock down his position. If you found something, that means he must be alive. Put in a request to the commander for immediate approval to begin a search. Actually, the commander has already ordered us to prioritize tracking down surviving Yorha members. If you find 9S, let me know, okay? Will do. To be out. Aw, so she does care about him. I mean, you know, they huh. are I need partners you to scan to for any degree. nearby black box signals. Mm. And I think uh, the commander would be very mad if, if he died. No signals detected. Uh, so next time on Near Automata, we will be searching for 9S. may be located in the resistance camp. Proposal. Further information should be obtained from the Um, I leader. guess... Let's go. We'll let Pod finish his speech and call it an episode. So, catch everybody next time.